asteroid tracker, NASA captures incredible space rock video completing near-Earth approach. Asteroid experts at U.S. Space Agency NASA and the University of Hawaii released a remarkable video of a space rock passing our planet. Last month, astro astronomers discovered a 65-foot asteroid, it's about 30 meters across, as it hurled close to our Earth. It's asteroid 220-001, 220 meaning was only discovered this year. It was dubbed, proceeded to safety fly to fly back Earth, uh, by Earth uh, a week later on July 27. So it was recently found, as you can understand. Incredi incredible images of the approaching asteroid captured by experts at the University of Hawaii Institute for Astronomy, IFA, using telescopes from the Las Cumbres Observatory, LCO, Global Telescope Network. The University of Hawaii's PanStars-1 telescope atop Haleakala's is the world's leader in finding near-Earth objects. The discoveries from the Maui-based project are used by a local high school, local high school students to direct follow-up observations with LCO. J.D. Armstrong, High Star Director, said in a statement, it's great to see our high school students being part of cutting-edge science using data from Hawaii's observatories and around the world. These are our future STEM scientists, science, technology, engineering, mathematics superstars. High Star students Eskin Guarin and Jed Teagarden received a high honors from leading cutting-edge asteroid tracking. And during the COVID-19 pandemic, observatories around the world temporarily ceased operations, but the global pandemic has not prevented the location of the rogue space rocks through remotely operated telescopes. The search for near-Earth objects is funded by NASA's Planetary Defense Coordination Office through its NEO observation programs. The release of the amazing new footage coincides with news China is moving ahead with lunar South Pole and near-Earth asteroid missions. The communist state, China, that is, is continuing its aim at eventually at least equaling NASA's ambitions to explore space rocks. China is advancing the development of the Chang 7 lunar South Pole mission and a complex campaign to study comets and return samples from a near-Earth asteroid with a single orbiter. The China National Space Administration issued a call last month to all students to propose science experiments for the multi-spacecraft Chang-7 lunar mission and an asteroid and comet exploration project dubbed Zheng He. The new, the new suggests development of the Chang-7 mission of China is making progress. Last year, CNSA issued an international call for science payloads for the near-Earth asteroid sampling return and Zheng He comet orbiting mission. And Chang-7 is part of the expanding Chinese lunar exploration program targeting the moon's south pole. The expansion builds on a plan initiated at the start of the uh, of this millennium to orbit the moon, land on the surface, explore it with rovers, and collect and return samples to our Earth. The Chang-7 mission will consist of an orbiter and a lander which will deploy both a rover and a mini flying probe. A relay satellite will support the mission, and this will likely be an updated version of the Quenchkao Relay Station satellite for the ongoing Chang 4's lunar farside mission. The launch is scheduled for 2024 on a Long March 5 heavy lift launcher, and Chang's 8 designed for in situ resource utilization and 3D printing technology tests will follow as a step st stepping stone to a planned permanent robotic base that China wants to have on the moon. So I hope that the U.S. will beat them to it because the space race is really on. This is by Tom Fish on Express UK. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. 
So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece, in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.